good morning guys welcome back to another daily vlog it is wednesday today and this morning i'm taking my drone i'm taking this and we are going on a film shoot as i said guys today i'm going all the way to essex which is three hours away for a film shoot with my drone so we're going to essex we're going to film a bit there then we're going to drive to london after so i'm going with my uncle today let's make this an awesome vlog i hope you're having an awesome day as well and if you're not put your problems aside for this vlog let's all start positive let's all start positive contrast to everything we do no negativity in our lives from now on guys let's go guys this next 10 to 50 minutes or however long this vlog's going to be it's going to put a big fat smile on your face to take this guy with me i can get with us drone and then he's gonna come pick me up in a minute guys since you just got to the film shoot now we're going into the studio i'll show you some of the stuff i'll show you the studio and i'll show you all the equipment in there so we're just about to go in now here we are this is some of the equipment in the room here it is so this is all their equipment on the film shoot screen so we've got cameras here we've got like black magic cameras steady cams all that here so this is it here equipment bit tripods as well all the big tripods i need a proper big tripod guy for when i'm doing that cheering and stuff at home that's what i need the tripods for so yeah it's an awesome place here i'm gonna go and get filming in a minute. we've got to do a couple of drone shots in the park and do some nice time lapses as well and just film basically place basically this is a film for me and for them everybody there's three people me my uncle and patrick who's another boy here we all want to do a different film but we're gonna combine every single shot and do a big film at the end of the month but yeah you won't see any of the film footage today i'll put some footage in it but i can't put too much it's obviously secret so mickey's just putting together the black magic now so it's gonna put it together <laughs> the camera's insane. So with this, you can actually make some great shots from yeah. from different angles because it's got its own like sort of elephant feet. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's really good. That's really nice. So you can put this on the camera. Yeah, so it stays. Movement. and get the steady shots also you could you can get it from any angle <laughs> so it goes up yes yeah, so is that drone. yeah like drone shots yeah so you can walk it around i'm talking like that that is so heavy <laughs> Guys, we're just leaving the office now. We're about to go and do the film shoot. So let's go. Let's leave. We're about to go into the park to do the drone bit, to do the drone shots for the movies. We're about to go and do that now. Mickey's just going down there with his camera to do it, and then yeah, we're going to do the drone. What's going on, guys? Is that all police following one car? Someone important? It could be like the president, or I'm not even sure. Jack Straw. Who do you think it is? Jack Straw. Ah. Oh. Look, guys. These there, guys, were behind the van. Now there's all over there. It's someone important, obviously someone from the politics i think it was an old prime minister or someone like that it wasn't like the president it was just an old old politic or an old prime minister so we're just in the park now we're going to take up the drone get a couple of drone shots for the for the film they want to make so basically what we're doing we're going to take it up over these trees and just fly it around and get some awesome shots so we can set up now we're going to set up all the gear now that's the camera gear and that's the drones over there and all the other cameras <laughs>
literally just finished up of all the drone footage and all the cam footage which they needed and which I wanted as well. You saw some of the drone shots, yeah, but here's the drone. What? Here's the drone just Look coming down. That. One sec, follow that. It's very hard to see on my camera. Ah, oh, that looks good. You watch it when it comes back down and what will go over the top of it. Watch, 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 watch. Wait. Watch, 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 watch. <laughs> Oh, that's cool. Watch. Sick. <laughs> that's awesome. That is cool, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, I have to send my footage by email. Okay. okay. Yeah, I'll send it. Will you be able to do that? Yeah. Well, okay. well, well if I send it to you. Pardon? On we transfer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, we do it now, mate, for the hard drive. Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, we do it when we get back then, to the studio. Then we can mix everything, mix and match the whole day. Yeah. No, I think it would look really cool though, like with the drone shots and that camera shot. Yeah, the drone looks I amazing. Can't wait. Yeah. I don't want to get even the option. <laughs> back to the studio now, we're going to get all the footage we just filmed onto all the computers and we're going to exchange. So they're going to get my drone shots, I'm going to get their camera shots. And basically, this whole vlog is, that's it, we today is so just big films, like literally me, Patrick, and then. Mickey, but all of us were shooting different movies. So I was shooting obviously for the vlog, they were shooting it for his movie, pa Patrick was doing it for his movie, and Mickey was doing it for his movie. So all of us are doing different movies. I've just done a quick interview with Banana Studios. We just spoke about why I do vlogging, what I enjoy most of it, and we just spoke about literally what I want to learn from the film industry and what I want to learn and the experience I've learned today. What have I learned? So we've just done a quick interview. Here it is. What have you learned so far today? So far today, I've learned how to work in a team, so like teamwork, and how to organise different storyboards, um, how to organise cameras, and different camera angles, and stuff like that. But most of all, like working as a team, and organisation. What got you into doing uh, YouTube? So, what got me into doing YouTube? I always love to be able to create content that people enjoy and make people happy. And I always just love to be able to literally get a camera and film what you want about any content that you have to do, about any content you want to do, you have that creativity and the freedom to do it yourself. Guys, I just got home from the big film shoot today. It was an absolute awesome film shoot and I've just got home from the gym as well. I came home and went straight to the gym because I missed Muay Thai training tonight where it was a three hour car journey from Essex where we came from. So it was a long journey, but I've just came home now and it's now nine o'clock at night. It is nine o'clock, so I came back from the gym. I had an awesome gym session. I just went and done an ab workout tonight, a nice ab workout. But now I'm home and I'm literally just editing the vlog. The vlog looks awesome, guys. I'm just editing it. My Premiere is still broken. I still haven't got my Premiere back, so I'm using rubbish eye movie. I remember it's all rubbish, but compared to Premiere standard, it is rubbish. But I get my Premiere back tomorrow. It's basically been updated and I need to get all my files back and all my old intro and all my new outros and intros back. I hope you guys have enjoyed today's vlog i've tried extremely hard to vlog i've tried extremely hard to get good content and i hope you guys have enjoyed it it was something different for all of us and i just really enjoyed it it was a great experience for me it was a great atmosphere to be able on, to be on a film shoot and to see all the different camera angles see everything you have to do and it, guys my uncle Mickey, who uh, I called Mickey in the vlog, that camera he had was £10,000. The Black Magic camera, £10,000. He's just insane. But he also bought that for his film career. He's been doing filming, guys, for about 10 years now. And that's what I said to him. He said, So, what do you want to get out of London from the experience? And I said, In two years' time, when I go to LA, I want to be able to make my own films, my own documentaries, and be able to make vlogging to a different stand with me. I want to be the best vlogger in the world when I'm in LA and when I have over 1 million subscribers. I want to be the king of YouTube. The drone shots we've done today was awesome. They absolutely love the drone shots, but they want me to do some more. We fly the drones over the Thames, and I said, why not let's fly the drone over the Thames? You might get in trouble, but let's do it. But obviously, I need to, I might not be able to do it yet, because you know, as I said in yesterday's vlog, my drone is actually broken. I can only fly at a certain altitude today. So I've got to send my drone back tomorrow morning, and hopefully it will be back by next Monday. It might take a long time, guys. It could take up to a week, they said, because they have to get the drone, repair it, and then try flying it. If it doesn't work, then they send me a brand new drone, but hopefully they will just send me a brand new drone because in my opinion guys, the drone is actually buggered, it is broken. Guys, quickly before I finish today's vlog, I just wanted to say, don't expect success overnight. Don't be afraid to fail many times. Failing, guys, is a good thing. Making mistakes in life are good things. We're only humans, guys. We'll make so many mistakes in life, but it's just all about how you overcome it and how you carry on pushing forward. As I said, don't expect overnight success because it happens over time. It happens over long periods of time. Progress is slow, guys. It takes 
time, effort and dedication. It will come, just keep doing what you love. As I said guys, and Roman Atwood has said this before, Casey Neistat has said this before, all the big YouTubers have said this before, money is a byproduct of doing what you love. If you do something you love so much and you get good at it, money will come. I couldn't care less about money guys, I don't give a crap about money, the only thing I want out of this channel is to motivate an audience of 1 million people and to retire in LA. And that's all I want and that is my dream, that is my goal. I'm going to finish today's vlog here, if you did enjoy this video then please smash the thumbs up, if you can hit 300 likes on this video it would just be insane don't forget to be yourself because you're all beautiful you're all amazing i love you all be yourself army baby just keep smiling just keep positive and keep being yourself